I ain't no monument to justice. I ain't no monument to Buford T. Justice. I lost my hand! He was often in the New York Times crossword puzzle when I did it. I don't know if he's still in it. Is he someone who's just rolled off into the pages of history, bound volumes, microfiche? People know him, but he's not something that people are thinking about actively, this guy. Oh yeah, tennis player Arthur. Monument in Richmond, Virginia. Did you know there's a monument to him in Richmond, Virginia? To balance out everything else? Arthur Ashe. Stadium. I mean, how do you get something named after you if you're not a corporation anymore? You have a symbolic presence. You're a symbolic presence because of the role you played in men's tennis. Because you had HIV. Because AIDS is what finished you off. Because you're a statue that carries as much meaning as someone wants to project onto it in bronze, in stone, with a plaque, with your name, with a name that people either know or don't, with a name that people don't even have to see a statue of to think of if they're sitting on the number two train taking the express down to 42nd Street on their way to work and filling in a four-letter clue that ends in E and begins with A-S-H.